What up, MetaZoomaniac? So today is February 29th, 2024. This day only comes once every four years. So I thought I'd do something crazy. We're gonna open up a Black Friday MetaZoo promo pack, a pack of Wilderness, a pack of Nightfall with the gold star. I think that means it's gonna be black on the outside, I think. And the super rare and maybe you shouldn't open because you'll never find one of these again. Uh, Kryptonation decks. That's going to have one of these holofoils. So we're going to put those two aside for a moment. So this is the regular holofoil you normally get. Right? I did pull a Mothman and a Green Man, but it's the old holofoil, the regular one. But the MetaZoo has a crazy, super awesome, delicious special foil. So, hopefully we can get another one. Maybe the Mothman, maybe we'll get a chess scene. We'll be like, oh, well, whatever. But whatever we pull, we're gonna get all these cards graded. So this is kind of like the pre-grading uh, video before, I don't know, maybe three months from now when we get them all back and find out what they graded. So let's go with the Black Friday promo first. It's gonna be Sam Sinclair. It's probably Calipode or something. But you never know. I don't like leaving MetaZoo products sealed. And oh my goodness, this is Calipo. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, sometimes you should leave products sealed, but I never do, because if I did, I wouldn't have either of those black inks with that crazy hollow foil. So there's Calipode. That's nothing too crazy. So we're gonna get that just down here. <laughs> Well, hopefully opening these decks is a little more exciting. And Snipe is very popular in Wilderness, apparently. I've literally been on Discord in my eBay sales video in the last one. Snipe Playtester as a pristine 10 or whatever sold for $910. Meanwhile, Kickstarter booster boxes are selling for $950. So if I had to choose any card out of here to pull for the hollow, I want Snipe. So it's the regular, not even no hollow foil. This is the regular first decks that came out. Let's see what our hollow is. Honestly, I hope I pull Snipe. But um, I doubt anyone would guess those cards. If you watch part one, you know I already pulled those cards, but let's find out if you got it right. Which card will it be? I don't know what Snipe is. Did you get it right or wrong so far? Oh, it's coming up. I can see a little shininess. So it's gonna be something in the hearts. So five of hearts is what? Stone eating. What? What does that say? Stone eating. Graticus? What the hell is that? Nobody guessed that. Five of hearts. I guarantee anyone watching this video is like, what? Okay, let me just put that into a sleeve. What the hell is that? Okay, that's. <laughs> Let's just look through the rest. I doubt there's another hollow. I've never seen someone get two hollows, but with MetaZoo, you never know. Just look, anyways. Okay. Now, then again, if I get the. Oh, so it's purple. Oh, yeah. Now, there's a lot of cards that I would love to have here as the hollow hit. Okay, so we got those out. Like, a lot. Ooh, that looks nice. Damn. Okay. I mean, there's Old Scratch. There's obviously Wendigo, Headless Horseman, Grim Reaper. There's um, obviously the Mothman card. I believe the Mothman is the Queen of Hearts in here. So that's what we're hoping for. Oh, it's not going to be, so it's going to be 
Six of spades? No. I thought it was coming. I thought I saw it. Oh yeah. And I wonder what everyone guessed is going to be the card for this one. Hopefully I worded that right in the first video so everyone's guessing for this video. Oh. Okay, I thought it was coming up. I must have just saw the regular hollow edge. So we want the next one to be it. Nope. So there's the Mothman. It's not going to be Mothman. I think we're getting there. Hopefully it's like, you know, an ace, king, jack, or queen. Uh, where's the eight? Oh, there it is. We're getting there. Oh, come on. Just a few more numbers. Oh, it's a three. Three of hearts. What's three of hearts? Oh, man. Alaskan snipe? Oh, wait a minute. People like snipe. I wonder if that has any premium value. People are going crazy for snipe lately. Hmm. Oh, no, sorry. Alaskan. Arkansas snipe. Interesting. Okay. Now for the big moment. I don't know if I'll ever get another chance like this, but it is February 29th when I'm opening this. So, you know, if it only comes once every four years, you should do something totally different and unique on this day. Come on. This is going to be wild. So this is the deck that I know Nick Strength and Pokemon's been opening a lot of these. He's trying to find out which one has a crazy hollow foil. This is what you want. You want this deck right here with the special MetaZoo wrap on it. Oh my goodness. I've never opened a deck of cards. Well, we'll keep the wrap on it even though I butchered it. Okay, let's get it open. Oh. And what's special about these decks, when you take it out, it's actually wrapped in other plastic right here too. I'm gonna try and rip that off as nice as I can. Oh my goodness. Okay, very, very careful. Cut that plastic. There we go. Okay. Ooh, that looks nice. Okay, drum roll. What card do you think it's gonna be? I hope it's an ace. I don't care which ace. I just hope it's an ace. I mean, the Mothman would be epic, but here we go. I don't know if I'll ever get another chance at this. But it doesn't really matter what card it is. Hey, there's the Ace of Clubs, or Ace of Spades, sorry. Oh. Pretty exciting right now. Because I'll probably never get another shot at this card. And even if it's like in the middle of the deck, it's coming up, it doesn't like, I'll try to explain this quick, so. In the other decks, if you saw that it was after six of hearts, you knew it was going to be seven of hearts, right? Or if we saw the four of hearts, the next heart, three of hearts, we know that's going to be the hollow. In this deck, the hollow card is just an extra card. You still get the full deck. But with these older decks, that three of hearts, there's no other three of hearts in the deck. So they kind of screwed up. But this one's just a pure bonus card. So wherever it appears in the deck doesn't mean it's going to be the next card, if that makes sense. We're coming up. Oh shit, if it's another Ace of Spades. Oh, there's the Mothman. It still could be the Mothman, even though it's not in that spot. Ace of Hearts. Oh, it's coming up right away. It's a little nerve wracking. It's had to do something crazy on May 29th. Okay, it's coming up. Oh. Okay. Come on, is it gonna be an ace? Oh, it's a two. Oh man, see, it says six of hearts, but the next card should be like a seven of hearts or whatever, but it's a two of something. Oh, what's a two that we could hope for? Uh, wait, I'm gonna cheat for a sec. I'm gonna look at another deck of Krypton Nation and see which two we would wanna get. So I just have some other decks here. 
Let's see. If there's even a good two. I mean, no matter what, it's gonna have that crazy hollow foil, right? So it's gonna be a pretty exclusive card. So here's an older deck that I previously opened. I'm just gonna see what a good two would be. It's probably a black two as well, I think. Chibi Mothman, that'd be cool. Okay, so two of spades would be cool. What other twos would we want? Dingbell, two of hearts, okay, so that could be cool. Okay, so those two would be not too bad so far. What's uh, this one? Oh my god, it's just so sticky. Two of clubs. GG Bird, okay, I hope it's not a two of clubs. <laughs> and what's the diamonds? Oh, these cards just stick together so much. So that hollow foil. Where is it? Two of diamonds is Gumbaroo. Okay, Gumbaroo is kind of cool. So we want two of spades, because then that'd be a chibi Mothman. So none of them are too crazy as our options, but we're gonna find out. Okay. Remember, we want two of spades would be preferable. Two of hearts or diamonds? Oh no, that's Gumbaroo, isn't it? Ah. <laughs> Not bad, but hey, people do like Gumbaroo, he's a stinky little shit, so... Oh yeah, oh yeah. And there's that special hollow foil Out of that pack, right? So we're just going to get that sleeved up really quick. So, yeah. What'd you do on May 29th that was extra crazy or different? To celebrate such a weird day? And, yeah, comment below, and we'll see you in the next video.